the four by four. My favorite base to build as a small group that enjoys snowballing. The base has enough storage to suit most groups' needs. Upkeep cost for the base isn't too expensive. It has interior peaks which don't fall off core is breached. Most people go through walls in online raids, so you don't want your peaks to fall when that happens. The base also features a shooting floor with exterior peak bounds, perfect for dealing with door campers or when you're getting online raided. Okay, let's build the base now. If you want it to be fully stone, there's only two boxes of stone. If you want to build like how I built in the preview, which I recommend, I'll put the build cost on screen now. Uh, building the base is pretty easy. You just start with a two by two core. You put a wooden floor at the top. That's gonna be your jump up for the next floor. And you put your doors down. You know, just build it however you'd normally build your two by two core. typically place my tier 2 right here, that way I can use it for jump up to the next floor until I get a ladder hutch down. When you're ready to expand your base, break this wooden floor and start building up your 2x2 two two like so. On top of the third floor, that's where you want to put your peak down, so you're going to have to add wall frames. And then you put double doors or garage doors, whatever you want over there later. Okay, now that you got the 2 right 2 cord on, now it's time to work on the peak downs. It's super easy. Just add a layer of squares around the 2 by 2 core, like so, and build up. Make sure to add two entrances, though, in case of door entrance. Now it's time to start building the peak bounds. I build them like this, and I think this is the best way to do it. But if you know a different way that you think is better, you can let me know in the comments.
Now that the peak downs are done, you want to seal them off like so. You also really want to add wall frames like this. So that way, if the core gets breached, the peak downs don't fall. It's super useful that they don't fall. Next step is shooting floor. It's also super easy to build. You can really build your outside peaks however you want, but this is just how I normally do it. And that's the build. Cost array in the preview is 12 rockets. Cost array right now is 8. You should honestly just upgrade the base to whatever resources you have on hand. I even built my peak downs out of wood one time. And I want to raid the fence with them. The base is designed for the smaller group that likes to server hop and snowball. I don't really build bases that are suitable for offline raids. Because to be honest, there isn't a base that is good for offline raids. These days, clans don't really care about how many rockets it takes. They're just going to raid you. Like, I got raided three times in a row and like within like three days and they sh sent like 90 rockets to my base like it, it don't really matter like if you're gonna get offline you're gonna get offline there's nothing that's gonna stop it so i just build for all online and yeah that's what i do if you liked the video leave a like if you disliked it leave a dislike um i stream live on twitch almost every day and yeah i'll talk to y'all later